Do you treat your top performers like balloons? I'm guessing that you probably have some top performers in your organization. They do great work, so when a new project comes up, you give it to them because they're good. The problem is you're kind of treating your top performers like a balloon. Imagine that this is the average person's work day. They feel comfortable with it. They know they can get things done. But then you add a little bit more to the job. Okay, they'll have to figure things out, maybe stay late, come in early, but they'll get the job done. But then you keep adding one more task and one more task. You figure the person's really good. <laughs> what does a little more work mean to them? Well, it could mean big problems because usually one of two things happens. The first is when you keep giving someone more and more stuff to do, well, eventually the balloon may pop. Person says, hey, take this job and shove it, they're out. You lose a good person. The other scenario, the person tries to get all the work done, but it's impossible. So over time, productivity goes way, way down and stuff just doesn't get done. Neither alternative is good. So before you add work to the person, you need to make sure you check with them to see if it can be done, if it's possible. We'll have more about this in our next clip, but for now, the big point is don't treat your top performers like balloons.